Nice to meet you both. Hello. Hi. Hey, um, tell me how these uh, incredible roles found their way to both of you. Mm. Oh, in the first season, uh, I was sent the script with the pilot, um, and it was in January, I think, in February, um, which is a very, very busy time for actors. Um, and it was just the script that really stood out for me. There was a lot of very samey pilots that felt very familiar um, and perhaps predictable, and this one was not in any way. It was quite, quite shocking and also very, very interesting. Yeah, I, you know, I, I auditioned months, months prior, and then I was working on a theater play, a Bob Marley musical, oh. with, with where Kwame is the artistic director, amazing man. And then um, I got a call that I booked it. Well, I got a call for a callback, you know, where I spoke to Anthony, my first conversation, and I was just like, who is this amazing man right. who is basically now family off of one conversation? You know, I was like, book it or not, I love that I know you now. And uh, then I put myself on tape a second time, and then I booked it. Are these emotional roles to play? It seems like they would be. I think across the board, <laughs> there's yeah. a lot. There's a lot expected of you as an actor, and I, but it's a wonderful thing to get to play with as well because the things that these people go through uh, is always very surprising, and it's always sort of stepped up to the next level as well. Yeah, I, I agree. I think the step up is it. Like they're mm. always fighting for something. So as much as it's emotional, you don't get lost in that because there's no time to to kind of wallow in yourself. Mm. And if you are, someone's forcing you and demanding that you show up. And you touched on something actually that wasn't even in my notes, but I, I want to bring it up because this took place, you know, in the past. But the relevance really can kind of stick to what today. Uh, Sticking up for yes. what you believe me. Yes. I know. Mm -hmm. I was at the march with my mom. Oh, nice. Yay. Good night. There could be many more. Yes, yeah. yes, they will. That's the thing, and there must be. Yeah, I, I think the parallels, particularly in the second season, are so obvious because the second season is very, very political, and we're in a very tumultuous political you know, world right now, atmosphere. And it is a time where people must be proactive in, in the show. People are having to do that and, and in life right now, absolutely. And I'm very glad that you marched. Every, have you seen, you know, mm -hmm. all over the world, everybody? I don't that think was, any... That was extraordinary, actually, when you see that, all the images oh, it, of all the amazing. different countries give me, give and cities. Yeah. yeah. Well, I did it because, and people asked me, and uh, the things that were said about women, you, you took a shot at my mom. Right. Mm. I'm not going to put up with that. No. But you, mm -hmm. you can't do that against women. You can't do it in a, in a racial type thing. Uh, here I go. I worked on the Hillary campaign, and I worked on President Obama's last campaign mm -hmm. right. as well. So that's why I march, and that's why I'm going to continue to march. Absolutely. So. And that's what's a wonderful thing. And you know what? It was, a, it was an entirely peaceful march, right? I believe yeah. in America there were no, no arrests, I, I, I think. No, very peaceful. And it was very yeah. inspiring, and I loved it. Yeah. I have to ask this, though. We're getting ready for season two. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now, what do we do? Because I'm telling you right now, season one, y'all really got to us. But what, what do we look for in season two? How do we prepare for what is going to be just an incredible season two? I, I think you just got to go on the ride. There, I don't know that you can really prepare yeah, because it's going to so. surprise you because you think it's going one way and then it will completely flip on you. So yeah. don't be too attached to anybody. Don't, uh, you know, <laughs> don't feel like you have a set of expectations. It, and just sort of go with it and, in, and enjoy knowing these people. You've had a whole season with these, these characters, so watch them learn and grow and, yeah. Yeah, 